What's going on guys, back with another Trail Boss video and in this video we're going to be installing a little preventative mod that's going to help ensure that the paint stays good because if you've had a Silverado or basically any truck you know getting in and out of your truck can take a beating on it and if you don't know what I'm talking about let's go ahead and look at it. So these things are very easy to scuff up and eventually wear the paint down. So I've literally got how many? 1300 miles which is a lot I've been driving too much anyways that has been very enjoyable but this place right here will take an absolute beating even with steps i wear boots like all the time so it's just really hard on this we're going to take and clean this up all these scuffs should come off it's not worn through the paint but if you don't get ahead of this it will definitely wear through the paint these guys so they're actually designed for this truck and once we get them laid out and everything essentially they're going to go right here and prevent any scuffing and they should look really good so let's go ahead and clean this up might have to clay bar this to get all these scratches out and uh then we'll get these things installed elbow grease hopefully this will come out man this is crazy it's literally 1200 miles she's already scuffed up pretty good i think that's it guys i think that's as good as she's gonna get I got it for all four, which don't mind the rear is destroyed by um, the dogs. I don't really even know if anyone's... What in the factory defect is that? <laughs> oh, GM, I love you so much with your amazing paint. <sighs> nice, nice. Let's see if Lauren's been doing good looks like she has just, man, maybe i just dragged my feet really bad probably is the case let's go ahead and throw our driver front they are labeled make sure you see them front driver side rear driver side etc so let's see how this thing should line up it covers pretty much the entire way even though like right here is the hot spot but this is good this is good so in order to make this I think we'll go ahead and throw, probably gonna go ahead and peel this side up. I don't know if this is the best way to do it, but this is the way I'm doing it. So just like that, nice and protected. Didn't get completely straight with it, got a little bit off center, but I mean, it's not a big deal. This is here to protect the paint. You're only gonna see this is when the door is open. Matches really well with the side steps. And now we have protected rockers or whatever you wanna call this. So I'm gonna go ahead and not bore y'all with the rest. Let's go ahead and get them knocked out and then we'll catch up with y'all and show you the final product. We're all done and it's gonna be awesome. So. Got that one lined up, y'all saw that. Got this one thrown in there. And if you're not familiar with what I'm talking about, it's basically like this, you step in, then you drag your foot up like that. Now, not gonna have that issue. Got it all protected. Got that bad boy, and then got that one. So even all of our passengers, obviously it is, you know, it's not the prettiest thing when the doors open like that, I will admit, but it is protecting our paint. and. How often do you got your door open? Dallas, what would you call them? Uh, I'm a dog, I don't care. Let me know in the comments if you went out and looked at your truck and it was absolutely destroyed right there and you had no idea and now you're probably gonna buy these to cover it up. Anyways, definitely a good thing to do right off the rip. Get that taken care of so you don't beat your truck up because GM's paint is pretty much trash. So with that being said, hopefully y'all did enjoy. I'll see y'all in the next one.